Hey folks, thanks for joining me. Um, so I'm here on a very toasty day here in uh, Northern California. Uh, it's actually not as bad as it was yesterday. Today is only uh, low 90s, yesterday it was high 90s. Um, so I'm not quite melting into the pavement just yet. Um, anyway, uh, thanks for coming on. It's poolproanswers.com. It's our YouTube channel. Uh, if you like pool content, you want to learn pool content for your uh, swimming pool, for your DIY needs, or even if you're a pool pro, you might uh, catch a couple of uh, hints along the way. You can like this video, subscribe, and hit the uh, bell notification as well. So today we're going to do a little bit of a uh, unboxing of a Pentair Superflow variable speed pump and a clean and clear 200 square foot filter. All right, so here's how the two units come. This is your Superflow Pentair Superflow variable speed pump. Uh, we see the color there on the label is almond. It's a pretty typical Pentair color. This is a one and a half horse power maximum speed pump. This is your clean and clear Pentair clean and clear. 200 square foot, same color. So I'm going to show you how to unbox these. Pretty straightforward. Just get your little box cutter. So this should, they're usually packaged up real nice. Just take that and put it to the side. You're always going to have an instruction manual installation manual um, along with uh, some other documentation for your warranty these are your unions don't lose these you need them okay and then this just pulls straight out okay so we'll put that right there for now so see the unboxing of the pump is pretty simple and straightforward Now, the filter on the other hand, most people want to open the filter and pull it out from the top. I like to tip it over and do it from the bottom. Okay, so we'll flip this over. I like to stand it up so that when I take the box off, the filter is standing just as it naturally should. That way I don't have to get it all scratched up and scuffed up trying to flip it over. There's not much to it. There's always a, uh, a bag of goodies inside, so you got to track that down. So in that bag, you're going to see also that there's the um, instruction manual, the warranty card. There's a pressure gauge in there, a little bit of Teflon tape, along with your uh, air relief valve. Now these smaller single cartridge filters are pretty simple to maneuver with one person. Even the larger ones aren't extremely heavy, um, but you just want to be careful. Uh, that you don't drop the uh, corners and break off any of the any of the uh, mold lines or tags. And that's pretty much it. Um, you know, just make sure you get your documentation off of your box here. You get a. I usually will cut one part of this label off right here. Uh, keep that for the records uh, make sure I get all the information sent in um, to the uh, manufacturer for the warranty um, do that online don't bother trying to mail those cards in just send it in online you're fine um, and that's it now I'm gonna get to installing this stuff uh, for that you're gonna have to look at another video